The model Union for the Mediterranean this year in the World Youth Forum has been a huge success for several reasons. One is the dedication of the young men and women who have participated in that model, not in terms of presenting different point of views of our member states, but in understanding the two main issues that we have discussed today, which is climate change on one hand and employment. They have shown a great level of maturity, a deep understanding of the issue at hand, and the willingness to come up with ideas that are extremely useful even for us at the Union for the Mediterranean in terms of improving the way we do things. I was impressed to see how many nationality were engaged today in that exercise. I saw Mexican, I saw people from the US. For that, it gives us a great pleasure to see that people from all over the world want to understand what are we doing regionally to create an area of peace and prosperity around the Mediterranean. Egypt is practically the largest Mediterranean nation in that organization. As we speak, extremely active in all of our activities in terms of projects, in terms of hosting meetings, in terms of shaping the policies and the action of that organization. World Youth Forum is gaining momentum year after year. I was here last year and it was already a huge success and an impressive gathering. Then again, you are surprising me this year with an even bigger event with the choice of subjects which are really relevant, relevant to you as young Egyptian and also young world citizen, choosing the subjects, the level of presentation, the maturity of our young men and women, and also the high level presence of heads of states, ministers who wanted to come and speak to you, young men and women, because you count, you are the leader of the future.